Today, we're gonna to show you how to set up the Amazon Echo Show 8, which we've got right here. The first thing you need to do is download the Amazon Alexa app and set up a username and password and log in. So we're just going to click on the Amazon Alexa app and open it up. And you wanna have the Amazon Alexa app open while you set up your Echo Show because then it will automatically link to the app. So we've got our Amazon Echo Show, plug in the power adapter on the back. We've got the Amazon Alexa app open and we've got ourselves logged in. Now we're just going to plug it in. Okay, I just plugged in the Amazon Echo Show 8. You can see it's powering up and we don't have to do anything yet because if you purchase this off of Amazon, what's going to happen, it's automatically gonna start loading up on the Amazon Echo app, which we've got open. getting your device ready. There we go. It populated, it said, we're preparing your Echo Show 8. Your Echo Show 8 is online and ready to use. It's also ideal to make sure that you are connected to the Wi-Fi network while you're setting this up and you have your Bluetooth on. Accessibility features. Swipe right or left to hear the options. Uh, we are going to turn on the screen magnifier that screen will work and able and then voice screen reader we're going to uh, just continue right now searching for networks here it says the echo show 8 is registered to me and uh, that's what pops up right here if you bought this from Amazon they actually preload it with uh, the information you need to get this set up we're going to click agree and continue we're going to click continue now we're going to give this a name And we're just gonna call it Echo 8 and click done. We can enter our location here and we're going to click continue. Choose your time zone, click continue. You can choose a location where this is at. We're just going to click skip for now. Checking for device updates. Uh, we're not gonna do Amazon photos at this time, but we're gonna click continue. You can set up appointments and reminders. We're going to click later. Echo Show can monitor your home. Uh, we are going to enable this so you can use it as a remote camera. And then we're going to click done. Stay connected with Amazon Sidewalk. Sidewalk is a shared network that helps compatible devices work better at home beyond the front door. If Wi-Fi is lost, Sidewalk enables certain devices to stay connected. Also, Sidewalk helps devices like water sprinklers and pet locators work over longer distances. Sidewalk uses a small portion of your internet bandwidth. We're going to turn that off for now. And then it says help find things with Amazon Sidewalk. We're going to opt out for now, but you can always change that in the future. And then make this device child friendly. We're going to click uh, no for right now. And we're just gonna let it keep loading. We're gonna click no thanks to this. And we're gonna click no thanks to this as well. Okay, it's loading up. You can ask me to add items to your shopping list. Find your list anytime in the mobile app and save money at grocery stores. Try saying, add milk to my shopping list. All right, we're just gonna skip through this, but you can try all these different things and okay, uh, okay. it will let that's you enough. then no use it. If you want to try later, just say, help me get started. Okay, so now after going through that, uh, it is set up, so let's test it out. Alexa, what's the weather in Chicago? Right now in Chicago, Illinois, it's 50 degrees Fahrenheit with clear skies and sun. Today's forecast has mostly sunny weather with a high of 57 degrees and a low of 42 degrees. On another note, I can help you search your neighborhood for fun things to do. 
Just ask me to find ice cream shops near you. Okay, so it gives you all kinds of different stuff in here and shows you uh, different tips that you can use. Uh, we're just going to say, remind me later on this. And then uh, what you've got, we don't want this. We do not want that at all. That's no good. Um, you've got your camera right here. You've got a shutter so you can close that. Uh, up here on the top, you've got your device in terms of uh, plus and minus. The speaker is on the back, and then you've got your mute button right here. And then uh, what's pretty cool is you can click. There are no active contacts right now. You can click on any of these uh, because this is a touch screen and it will show you what's going on. Uh, or you can go in uh, by sliding down and then you can control smart home devices, music, you can communicate, you can use this as a, fo a photo frame. Uh, you've got all kinds of stuff that you can do here. You can click on do not disturb or uh, if you want to do like a night mode, you can do that as well. So let's go back to our home. Let's see what some of these other ones are. Uh, this one right here says smart home favorites. So you could control those either by using your voice commands and or you could control those uh, by touching right on the touch screen. Uh, here we've got our list of stuff that we need to uh, purchase. That's our shopping list. So you could add to the shopping list. Alexa, add paper towel to the shopping list. I added paper towel to your shopping list. So then there's that shopping list uh, on there. That's pretty cool. Let's scroll down. We need to, what you can see, there's a little arrow there at the top. And that arrow allows you to pull down the uh, home screen and then do whatever you need to there. And then let's see what this star here is. Top connections. And then um, here, what do we have? This is a widget gallery. So all the different uh, widgets, they're like apps for your Amazon Alexa. You can add those on here. So you've got uh, music and audio, education and reference, and uh, smart home, Alexa discovery hub, all kinds of stuff that you can add. So this, some results. Uh, so here we are back at the home screen, just uh, press right here and it takes us back to the home screen. Now let's make sure that our device is loaded up here. So we're just gonna click on devices. Now here in the devices tab, you can click on the Echo Show 8 and uh, it is connected. And it shows that uh, we can put it in a do not disturb mode, adjust the volume uh, or activate the camera or uh, use the drop in feature to have video calling between uh, two Amazon Alexa devices. So that is how you set up your Amazon Echo Show 8. Hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time.